Hey guys, what is up? My name is Silver, and welcome back to Storytime with Silver, the series where I talk about interesting facts, not really facts, but stories that have happened to me in my life so far. And uh, yeah, today's episode is episode 4, and the topic is my first gaming experience. And you'll be like, you must be thinking like, first gaming experience, it sounds uh, kind of kinky. Not, pfft, no, not really, no. <laughs> My first gaming experience, or a couple of gaming experience, or basically how I used to start, like, how I started gaming, how I used to get into it, and, you know, how, yeah, I started playing games, yeah. So basically, what happened was, uh, it was more of a family-oriented thing that me and my family used to do. Uh, it wasn't just by myself, I wouldn't game by myself, pretty much, it would be mainly with my mum and my sister. Uh, what happened was, when I used to live in my old town, which is Daniloquin, New South Wales in Australia, you, if you're overseas and you're listening to this video, watching it, you'll probably have no idea where the fuck that is, but it is in Australia, obviously, blah blah blah, uh, now I live in Victoria, so, you know, this is where I used to live back then, and I was pretty much in primary school, which is, <laughs> probably also an, an, another Australian term or whatever, I wasn't in high school, Basically, uh, I think for America you call it elementary, is that like back when you're like, you know, 10 years old and such, I think, I probably have no idea because I've never lived on it, but anyway, uh, pretty much what my family, uh, mum, me and my sister used to do, uh, we would go to this place in Daniloquin, my old town, and there would be this, uh, I think, I don't know, I can't remember the actual place or what they did, but, I know it was, a, it was like a movie store, and it might have been a gas station as well, or something, or a bus station, like, where you could hire buses or something like that, I don't know, but there was a big, like, there, it was like a video easy, like a movie store, you can go in, buy a movie, rent it, you know, or buy it, and watch it, blah blah blah, but also they had games there, so it was like a, uh, it was kind of a game place where you could rent out a console for a couple of days, or overnight, for X amount of money, with a couple of games, and play them, pretty much. So that's what me and my family used to do. Um, that's how I first started gaming. Uh, so pretty much what mum would do, she would, uh, we would like, she would take us in the car, We'd go to this place, and I'll be like, oh, we wouldn't have, me and my sister wouldn't have any clue what we're, where we were going. It was like a surprise thing every time uh, she hired it out, and we played. Uh, so, I was like, re every time we went, I was like, really, really, really excited about this. I was like, holy shit, I want to do this, like, you know, I got really excited, I was, and I used to like, ask for it, and mum would say, no, but then she would su surprise us, so it'd be like, so it'd be like an awesome treat, like, going out for ice cream or something like that. Sounds cliche, but... I oh, know, it's it was special, it was something special to do as a family and stuff. So pretty much we would go and hire it out, we'd be looking there for a while for games and what to play, but the, normally the games that we, I'd actually play and what mum hired out were Harry, the like very first Harry Potter games, like Harry Potter, uh, Philosopher's of Stone, Harry Potter like Chamber of Secrets, and Prison Azkaban I'm pretty sure. Uh, and this was on the PS2 if you're wondering by the way. So we would hire them out, and pretty much it would be just me and my family just playing these games uh, over, you know, the course of the night and a couple of days or whenever we hired it out for. And uh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure that there didn't, there weren't memory cards there either. So it, you would have to leave the PlayStation on if we wanted to save, like, keep our thing going or something like that. Uh, there might have been, I don't know, might have been saves or something like that. I'm not too sure. I can't remember that, but. That is pretty much what we did, and I don't know, it was really fun, um, and <laughs> I'm not sure what other games I've played, I think I played uh, a couple of racing games, I th there might have been Need for Speed or got into, uh, I don't know, but at that stage of me first starting gaming, I was not allowed to play games that are like MA, M -A -R -D. M even. I couldn't play any of those because mum, you know, was like, no, you're so young, you can't play this, there's got blood and stuff like that, and it's, you know, like, I couldn't play any of those games because it would like, you know, it apparently it wasn't good for me, or something, I don't know. Um, but, <laughs> by that, where, pff, I got to the age of like 12, 13, I was already playing, uh, 
games like that anyway, but nonetheless, it's a thought that counts, right? But, you know, that's pretty much what I did for um, games, like, to first start off. Um, I did that for, a, me and my family did that for a while. I'm not too sure how long, but when we moved to the current town I'm in now, um, we got our first actual console, we, like, we bought it fi officially so we didn't have to hire it out all the time, and it, you know, it kind of drove away from the family cut type thing over the time, and, you know, I eventually got my Xbox, and it t turned into, like, a solo thing, mostly, or with friends, you know, um, but for the time that, when I was a little kid, and we did that, hired out the PS2, and a couple of games, and had, like, a family night with it, it was really special, and I, I pretty much missed that, but I'm sure we can, I can do stuff with, like, that with family again, but, you know, it's just, like, it's not as, um, I don't know, surprising, or, you know, as special or memorable, it could be, but, you know, as I was a little kid, it's just like one of those memories, you know, um, but that's pretty much how I did games back then, and, uh, until I got Macho first, you know, well, I did, it was more of a family PlayStation, but until the mum bought a official, like, PS2 fully and stuff like that, and, yeah, that's pretty much how I did it. And I remember the first time I played an M game, it was, Ar I, I remember specifically what game it was, it was Aragon, and I'm pretty sure I was on the PS2, and I'm not sure where I was when I was playing it, but <laughs> when I, the first time I played it, when I went to bed that night, I actually felt sick, because it was like the first game I've ever played with blood and stuff in it, and saw really, so I kind of like felt sick with myself that I was playing it, but uh, <laughs> shit, it sounds, I was like a kid, alright? So, but, you know, I grew into it, and, you know, I got into some more of the <laughs> blood games like that, you know, all the games I got now is like MA15 plus and shit, but, you know, I was a little kid, it was like new to me, um, but, you know, that is how I started, uh, gaming and stuff, I hope you enjoyed it, I hope you found it interesting, I know, it was kind of one of those memory things that me and my family used to do, and, you know, I enjoyed it, so I thought you guys might enjoy it too, just to give, I don't know, it's more of a personal level, letting you guys know, and, uh, sharing stories like that with you, so if you did enjoy it, be sure to hit that like and comment down below whatever you, the fuck you want, really. Just say if you liked it or, you know, any specific thing. It's really up to you. That's what the comment system section place is for, really. And I'll read it, of course, and reply to you. Uh, and, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Story time with Silver, and we'll be back soon with another story time with Silver. Not too sure when, but as always, there'll be daily uploads unless I get really let know. I'll, Definitely, it's daily uploads, alright, 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 uh, see, <laughs> daily uploads, either one upload or two uploads, it really depends on how I'm feeling, but, daily uploads as always, Dark Souls at 2 at the moment, so check that if you out if you want, um, and yeah guys, I'll talk to you guys soon, bye guys, I love you, thank you for watching, yeah. yeah.